Hey Anne-Marie, I am sorry that this has taken so long. My life has become crazy busy with the play and stuff. So yeah, I'm just finally getting time to sit down and videotape myself. So yeah, um, let's see what else is unimportant things. But what I meant to do yesterday before play and stuff and homework and me drowning in my life um, is because I heard that you gave my cousin a happy birthday poem and she said that one up to my entire happy birthday like everything I did I emailed her so I decided that I would finally give Jessie the shout out she's been wanting I meant to do this on her birthday but now it's the day after and it's a little awkward but happy birthday Jessie and dad and Kelly and people who have birthdays on March 20th but that's a lot of people so um, I'm gonna attempt to sing real quick so don't judge Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday to Jesse, Dean, Kelly, anyone else who has a birthday on March 20th, happy birthday to you. Clapping for myself because, yeah, I'm making myself feel better. But, so, Jesse, that shout out that you've been waiting for and you've been annoying me about, here it is. Happy birthday, Jess. You're welcome. So, yeah, um, I'm actually about to go see Divergent. Um, with some friends, so that's exciting. Um, I'll probably film a little thing like afterwards about my Divergent. So yeah, um, wish me luck on watching Divergent. You've already seen it, so I fingers crossed. Hope it's good. I love the book, so this is a uh, a test. Plus, I need to see how Shailene Woodley is because she plays Hazel. I'm excited. So yeah, I'm gonna go see Divergent, and I'll be back. So, Divergent was awesome. Yes, I agree with you about a lot of things that were wrong with it, like a lot of things, but Shailene Woodley was amazing. I'm really, really excited that she was so good because that means she's gonna be fantastic as Hazel in The Fault in Our Stars, which is literally what's on my mind 90% of the time these days. But speaking of The Fault in Our Stars, I'm actually gonna get to my topic that I had planned for Wednesday when I was planning to do this video and forgot. Well, I didn't forget. I was I was very aware that I had not done it. I just like, I don't have time. But anyway, on to topic. Um, I'm reading that I took the cover off, but this is it. Uh, this star won't go out. It's by Esther Earl, and it is the the girl who the Fault in Our Stars is dedicated to, and it is incredible. It's wonderful. I am halfway through it, and I'm already doing my book review on it, which says a lot about it. Um, this girl, uh, she was so strong and amazing, and she took life even though some, even though her life was very admittedly very hard and shouldn't have happened to someone of her age. She took it so strong and beautifully that it's it's inspiring, and I feel like Esther and I could have been really good friends because she really liked cats and Harry Potter <laughs> and John Green. So, you know, I feel like she would have been a great person to be friends with, and I'm really excited to be able to read her story and hear words from her and she was incredible and I recommend this book to people. It's it's beautifully written by a very inspiring girl and it's I, I have only good things to say about it and I'm, I haven't even finished it and I'm still I'm already doing my book review on it so Anne-Marie definitely read this book anyone else definitely read this book it's very good worth the read so yeah that is mostly what I had to talk about um my mind is like going 100 miles an hour because I have like a thousand things to be doing and I'm still trying to like be social and stuff but yeah so the, the star won't go out very good introduction by John Green he's pretty great and Divergent awesome movie uh book was better but usually is I I agree the the Triss and um four action was pretty good I wish you would have called him Tobias I wanted Will to be a bigger character, Peter to be meaner, you know, stuff like that. But anyway, um, go see Divergent. I know Anne-Marie has. It's a good movie nonetheless. I enjoyed it. It was a good way to get my mind off of my life for two and a half hours. So yeah, Anne-Marie, I will see you on Sunday. Jan-Marie out.